And welcome to The Rock Radar. My name is Smitty from the What the Hell Everything Podcast, another reaction through space to open rock and roll minds, and that brings me to Billy Strings. This will be the second reaction, but I've listened to Billy uh, enough to get a really good idea that I like him and a really good idea that I wanted to check out his tune with Willie Nelson, California Sober. Because if uh, it, it is an, any inclination that it has Willie Nelson, it's about weed, and I'm 100% about that. So, uh, Billy Fucking Strings, which was released uh, about a month ago, featuring Willie Nelson. And before we get into this radness, let me get the message out. On April 1st, 2021, I ditched a career I absolutely hated to better myself and do the things I've always wanted to do. And that included my growing love and obsession with Ireland. I want to learn everything. Culture, history, mythology, music, and the language. Which, if I'm being honest, looks really hard to learn, but I'm going to give it the old Smith try. Then, of course, there is my love of pubs and the role that they've played throughout history, and no better example of that than on that beautiful, beleaguered island in the North Atlantic, Ireland. April 1st, 2026, I depart for the Emerald Isle, and for one year, I'll hike town by town and conduct interviews with pub owners, pub regulars, historians, town know-it-alls, musicians, and basically anybody that wants to talk to me. If you'd like to support the project and the journey, basic Patreon support is only three bucks a month, but just liking a video or subscribing to the channel and following the journey is just as helpful. I'm always looking for volunteers to work as liaisons for the project too, so if you live in Ireland and know people, feel free to hit me up. This is a huge goal and I need all the help I can get. The Smitty Learns Irish podcast begins April 26th and will be my life's work. Thank you. And without further ado, Billy Strings featuring the man, the myth, the living fucking legend, Willie Nelson, California Sober. Is that Willie's bus? He's going on Willie's bus. Maybe not. <laughs> I want him to be. Like, that's my fucking dream come true, is to, like, just go hop on a bus with Willie Nelson. And he's like, oh, do you want to fucking smoke this? And yes, I do, Willie Nelson. Thank you. Well, I used to like to ramble with my good time friends and neighbors. Now I find I'd rather lie awake in bed. And I don't get to act and mean when I keep my buzzes clean and keep the hard stuff in the whiskey from my head. Well, I guess that's just the trouble. When you're always seeing double and the lines are getting twice as hard to see. What's the fuck? I've had years I don't recall, but I'm told I had a ball at least somebody did who looked a lot like me. That was Willie's guitar they showed. Uh, why is the name of that guitar escaping me? I know what it is, but it's the most iconic fucking m instrument probably in music history, at least in American music. So I'm California sober as they say. Back in the day, so I'm California sore as they say. Oh my god, I love this. <laughs> and there's honestly probably not a better picker, at least in this generation, than fucking Billy Strings. Back in the day, so I'm California sober as they say. 
honestly, because I do a lot of like Irish music reactions and I'm going down hard down the Irish music rabbit hole. And I always liken, you know, the basic instruments of like Irish music are a lot of the basic instruments of fucking uh, uh, American bluegrass and American roots music, banjos and uh, uh, fucking fiddles and things like that, you know. And I'm always like, is there because there's so many good punk rock bands that play Irish music with those instruments. And I've never heard like a punk rock rock approach to American bluegrass roots, something like that. But Billy Strings is one of those guys that can fucking pull it off. Like, I know he does so much music that is uh, layered, like, prog metal and things like that. Uh, I don't know if I've ever heard him take, like, a punk rock uh, twist on any of his stuff, but if there's anybody that can pull it off, he fucking could. And, of course, Willie Nelson. Fucking shirt say pass the doobie scooby. Fantastic, man. Fantastic. Anytime, any time Willie Nelson can just make a fucking appearance in anybody's song, it's instantly going to make it better. It's hard to make Billy Strings better, but uh, just that fucking voice, man. And as a picker, Billy fucking Strings. Billy fucking Strings. And that does it for me. Uh, Billy Strings request. You got uh, 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 your favorite band that nobody knows about. That's the idea behind the rock radar. You want to support the channel more. Uh, basic Patreon supports only three bucks a month. And then, of course, five bucks a month if we do live uh, set reactions or something like that. Uh, there you go. Link is in the description. Thanks so much, guys. What the hell? Everything.